had several ask what kind of banjo uh, that I play, the different banjos that you see on some of the songs. Uh, and so I was gonna take a little bit of time and try to show you what we've got. This is a Cox Raymond Fairchild edition. It was built by Jimmy Cox and, and I think his family uh, are uh, still building banjos. And then Raymond Fairchild commissioned it. And uh, so it's uh, one of a hundred. He did a hundred in gold and a hundred in nickel. And uh, it's a very beautiful instrument. Uh, there's a gentleman called me, invited me to his house, a uh, preacher friend. And we we're gonna pick a little bit. And he handed this one to me and we picked uh, a couple of hours. And he asked me how I enjoyed it. And I said, I really enjoyed it. That's a nice banjo. And he said, I'm glad you like it because the Lord told me to give it to you. And uh, so I thank the Lord for that. And uh, it's, it almost play itself. It feels so smooth. I've had it a little over 10 years now. And uh, it's uh, got some uh, Keith style tuners. They're not Keith, they're some other brand, but I've got Keith style tuners. Uh, detuners on it. I've still got the original uh, tuning pegs. It's got a beautiful dogwood. It's got a headless eagle on that first fret. It's supposed to be good luck uh, according to the Cherokee folklore. Raymond Fairchild was a Cherokee Indian and uh, many of you know that. It's got a signature uh, down there. It's a little faded. Uh, I've got a bad habit of choking up on the neck with my picking hand. And uh, it's got some beautiful engraving, if you can see it. Got some shapes engraved there, and it's got feathers engraved all the way around the, the hoop there. And then it's got feathers engraved on the armrest. And, uh, the wood is beautiful. And, uh, I don't know what kind it is or anything, but it's beautiful wood. And uh, I enjoy it. I like it. I've got it set up with uh, with uh, GHS JD Crow light strings on it. And uh, I did put uh, some medium uh, strings when I got it. I played with the heavy strings, and I put some mediums on it uh, after I got it, and. Uh, it killed it, and uh, it didn't sound any good. And I called the gentleman that gave it to me. I said, what kind of strings did you have on it? And he told me, and uh, so I got some of those and put on it, and since then I've changed to these, and I really like them. And uh, it's, it's got a good tone to it. I've got a slick head on it, and uh, I know some don't like that, but I've got, I like the slick, just plastic head on this one that gives it. I don't know. It's got the sound I like, and so I've left it alone. Uh, when you get it where you want it, you just don't touch it no more. And his name's Tim Brooks. That's what, that's what I referred to him as. This is Tim Brooks, the banjo. <laughs> 